Let the police do their work. Hey, Sullivan, can't you go any faster? You've seen how old this thing is. If we force it too much, we'll break everything. You can't... The blood is just beginning to coagulate. It died a short time ago. Killer whales have few predators. And there are no sharks in these waters. What creature could possibly have done this? You can't understand. You're not sailors. It's a sign. There's something coming. Something real bad. Don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. They're cops. They can't understand. The same goes for you, sir. Move along. They seem to be very agitated about a dead animal. <laughs> You're telling me? These fools think that putting the whale back in the water will bring about the end of the world. <laughs> They're superstitious. If only you knew. They only listen to Captain Fitzroy. And not always. And you. What brings you to our island? I'm looking for this address. Warehouse 36. Darkwater Harbor. <laughs> I like you, so I'll be frank with you. Don't go near the place. Don't try to get in. Why? Because I told you so. Learn to accept some friendly advice. Now, please, allow me to do my job. You That's can't understand. No You're not sailors. Omen. Oh, yeah? It's a sign. He's There's gonna get us coming. in trouble. Something real bad. Don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. Let's get him another drink. He's dry. In my bar, we don't serve troublemakers. Pure instinct. I behaved like a hun. And I sincerely apologize. Veteran, huh? 307th Infantry Regiment. Oh. Well, that'll be okay for now. But the war is over. Try not to forget it. I'm here for information, not for a fight. I prefer it that way. Speak then. I reserve the right to answer or not. Captain Fitzroy told me about a little pick-me-up. You want a drink? I wouldn't say no to a glass. Try this. I think we'll get along well. <laughs> I didn't expect to find alcohol on this island. What's the source of this miracle? You mean who? Our source of supply wouldn't like me to betray them to the first comer. I'll tell nobody. She'd know it anyway. Anything else? Do you know where this place is? Warehouse 36, Darkwater Harbor. The Hawkins Warehouse. I see, yeah. If I were you, I wouldn't hang around there. Why not? First off, there are rumors. Sailors from around here say you can hear noises coming from the warehouse at night. Screams, that sort of thing. Screams? And that's not all. There's the fate of its owners and all the superstitions that go with it. But I'll say no more. Anything else? What can you tell me about it? 
We all knew she was famous on the mainland for her paintings. Never understood why. Then, I don't want to speak ill of the dead. I've got what I need. Anything else? What can you tell me about her? We all knew she was famous on the mainland, then... Her vision. Was it so terrible? The way I see it, the truth is really a question of point of view. What do you mean by that? Do you still trust the truth after a bottle of whiskey? Her style made her famous. How would you describe it? Tortured? Yeah. Well, it wasn't normal. I mean, for a young woman with a child and all that. We saw them in the papers and we said to ourselves, who can paint such things? Is that how she sees the world? So they made you feel uncomfortable? You need to see them for yourself. Make up your own mind. I've got what I need. Anything else? The Stranded Whale. I guess this bar has been here a long time. What can I tell you? I'm a nostalgic sort of guy. The name, it reminds us of the golden age of dock water. When our whalers left for long months and came back, sweating and stinking of the oil and flesh of the whales they'd been hunting. It was a tough time, all the same. Ah, but steeped in glory. We've never known such wealth since then. That'll be all for now. What you looking at, stranger? I've rarely seen a woman who can hold her liquor so confidently. What gives you the right to judge me? Ah, it was a compliment. So what? Let me drink, stranger. I told you to beat it. Do you like our song? <laughs> We're true sirens. We may not be pros, but we give it all we've got. That's true. It's a reminder of the time when we were still fishing for whales off Darkwater Island. What brought whaling to an end? The whales, of course. They all disappeared. You exhausted the stocks. You could say that, yes. There were fewer and fewer of them. Until the last, the biggest. The one of the miraculous catch. <laughs> exactly. I've never heard this song before. Only people from here know it. It tells the story of the miraculous catch. It's a local legend? Watch what you say, young man. That catch saved our island. Ah. Where's the proof? We're the proof. Without it, the whole of Darkwater would have died of hunger in 1847. It's true. Everything happened, just as it says in the newspaper report. What report? The one that's framed right behind you. Our grandparents tasted its flesh. And it was delicious. I bid you farewell, gentlemen. Good night, stranger. So long. Bye. Then he said, you have no right to treat us like this. And the doctor... The miraculous catch. Apparently, the most significant event of the last 80 years. What did he say? He laughed. My God.
Hmm. Nightmares. Can hear things and voices whispering. Will follow its reader and appear at various locations. Gifted with its own consciousness. Until it finds a new reader. Charles Hawkins was a heavy drinker. And a debtor. Interesting. Charles Hawkins was a heavy drinker. And a debtor. Interesting. And then he said, You have no right to treat us like this. What can I get you? That'll be all for now. Prohibition is just a joke around here. That suits me fine. What did he call us just now? I said you were a bilge rat, and even a a, a poxed limpet. There's nothing you for you here you either. What you're doing? Beat it. Hidden in the fog? I'll shut up your big mouth once and for all. Optimistic. Damn stupid idiots. Get it. Nobody listens to us anyway. That's no way to treat an omen. Oh, yeah. He's going to get us into trouble. You can't understand. I've brought out the Charles Hawkins cargo manifests. They're on the table next to you. But in truth, you're likely to be- I wonder what Captain Fitzroy has got to say about this woman, Cat. These manifests are signed by Charles Hawkins, but that's all I'll get from them. Asilla. It finished up beat a souvenir from a more prosperous era. Fishing equipment. <laughs> Could do with some rust remover. This man and Fitzroy could be twins. What a macabre souvenir. From here, I see everything that goes on in the harbor. The hard-working lives of my sailors, the fights of the stranded whale. Even the antics of these wharf rats don't escape me. It's you who lays down the law around here. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I'm just the last serving captain on dark water. Tell me what I can do to help you. Your manifests have been blacked out. They're totally unreadable. Yeah, I saw that. I've got no idea who did it or why. I don't remember having countersigned anything special enough for someone to hide it. 
And why obliterate the dates, as well as the goods stored in the warehouse? You mean that the dates have some meaning? I'm surprised Charles Hawkins had goods to store, knowing that whaling stopped in 1847. I see that you're interested in the history of our island. Indeed, maritime activities ceased altogether at the end of the last century. I imagine that the Hawkins family had other types of contracts. But you don't know with whom? No. It was none of my business. I'm just back from the wharves. The dead killer whale is unsettling the sailors. Ah, yes. Us men of the sea are superstitious folk. I examined its wounds. I know of no creature able to cause them. And I took you for a detective. Believe me when I say that these wounds are significant. Come, come. You've only just arrived on dark water, and already you think like a sailor. The police took the decision to put the killer whale back into the sea. You've got to understand them. They didn't know what to do with it. I think that was a mistake. Who says that whatever caused those wounds is no longer in these waters? <laughs> you think we should have kept it? To look into the real cause of its death, at least. The miraculous catch. Is it a local legend? Not at all. It's an episode from our glorious past. Go read the story of the sailors' return to Darkwater Harbor. It's displayed on a wall of the stranded whale. I was looking at your photograph. The one of the man in front of the boat. Ah, yes, I can see the one you're talking about. Interesting resemblance. I thought it was you, but with a wooden leg. And for good reason. That's my father in the photograph. Your father? John Fitzroy, captain of the Scylla. His wooden leg is here. You can go and see it if you're interested. I found a threatening letter signed by a certain cat. What? I don't mind you visiting my harbor master's office, but I'd prefer if you didn't go through my affairs. Are you being blackmailed? Not exactly, no. That shyster wants to make us pay protection money. With any success? I wouldn't say that, but she terrifies my men as much as her own. Can you not do anything to stop her? Don't you worry about that. I'm looking for Warehouse 36. Do you know where it is? Look, it's right there. The warehouse is opposite the jetty. You can't miss it. Understood. You know who the building belongs to, don't you? It belonged to the Hawkins family. Precisely. Ship owners from father to son. I think that somebody here wanted me to search this warehouse. I shall be on my way. So come back and see me when you've got something new. saw what happened with those sailors. Don't hang around here unless you want trouble with the bootleggers. This warehouse looks abandoned. Why does it interest them so much? No doubt a question of territory, but I ain't asking. If you want to know more, go ask the captain. Good. Thank you. I've seen the kind of messages their boss sends. You're not scared of her. Of course I am. Everyone's scared of that woman. She's not interested in small fry like me. You, on the other hand, nose around too much, you'll have dealings with her. I shall take my leave. It looks like there's a way in under this grate.
I could use this old wench to lift. get us into trouble. You can't understand. You're not sailors. It's a sign. There's something coming. Something real bad. Don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. They're cops. They can't understand. You live here? Why did you do that, huh? We saw what you did to St. Brendan. Yeah, we'll teach you to come onto our island and ridicule our protectors. How can I be the one who defaced your saint? I've just come ashore, you idiots. That's true. We're as drunk as lords. You bet. You could have gone by without us seeing you. Do not rile me. You can hardly stand up. He's right. We're no match. For the moment. We're annoyed. It's understandable. There's you, our beloved statue, and then those two bozos behind us. Wait. Now that I think about it, it's got to be them. There's one of them who's always going back and forth to the statue. Quieter. That's all we need for them to hear us. What brings you to dark water? That statue represents your local saint. What do you mean by local, exactly? You wouldn't be looking down at us, like all townspeople do. Saint Brendan. He protected whalers and fishermen like us. Until those assholes defaced him. Peculiar house. Yeah, that's where we live. Our boat. It's not because it doesn't float anymore that we're going to abandon it. Isn't it a bit early for alcohol? We got nothing better to do anyway. There's not much work around here. Fitzroy gives us a few chores every now and again, but since the whaling station shut down, ain't a lot of jobs left around here. So we drink. The two guys behind you. What are they guarding? The bootleggers. Scum. They're protecting their territory. From whom, I wonder? They really don't have a choice anyway. They're more scared of cat than an attack by drunken sailors. If only they would kill each other. Is it cat who's shaking down Captain Fitzroy? Oh, hold on, hold on just a minute. We didn't tell you a thing. Nothing at all. Peculiar house. Yeah, it's... I've taken enough of your time. We'll see you later. Come on, you could tell me. No, who's this guy? No idea. You better keep it shut. <laughs> Why we don't have a clear conscience. Quiet. What's with you wandering around here like a hungry dog? We saw you talking to the two soaks. Go die of thirst, a lot of you. It'll stink less. I've got to enter the Hawkins warehouse. I guess it's going to be complicated. No, it's very simple, in fact. 
Fuck off. I don't give a damn about your racket. I just want to get into this warehouse. And we don't give a damn about you. Whatever your reason for wanting inside, there's nothing we can do for you. I've got to get inside. It's your boss who sent me. Oh yeah? And why didn't she say anything to us? She sent me to see who's filching her stock. I don't know what you're talking about. You got no proof to back up your claims, and I'd advise you against snitching. If I can't... What's with you wandering around here? We saw you total diet. So, who are you? Are you stupid or are you... Everybody knows us on Doc. I've just arrived. Let's just say we're standing guard for the own... And we let no one and... What happened to the statue of St. Brendan? Dreadful. What makes you think we did it? We're bootleggers, not savage. Who do you think defaced... What do I know? The sailors. Who else in your... Cap. She's your boss. What? She's the boss, yeah. Shut up, you dummy. You wanted to know that you all... She must be quite intimidating if she can make two men like you. <laughs> she re I hope you had a good dentist. No. But he only smiles with... She sounds frightening, your boss. And she doesn't like to be talked about behind her back. What are you guarding, exactly? Listen, Bonehead, we already told... I bid you, gentlemen, farewell. If I can't get rid of those two, I'll have to look for another way. Where do you think you're going? Who are these others? And why would I tell you? I'd like to know more about the Hawken. I don't think so. I thought that the Hawkins case had- That's true. So what are you doing on guard? <laughs> Who's asking? What more can you say- Not much more than whatever- They were all burnt to death, right? The whole map- Don't get it into your head. What do you mean by- The only one left there is old Sila. He can be unpredictable. Especially if a stranger- Is he a danger to the- No. He's in his own home. How could you be dumb enough to leave the entrance to the warehouses unguarded? Keep your voice down. Why not go and shout at the cat while you're at it? I don't want to end up with her little knife under my throat. It's a stiletto, you idiot. And with that smell on your breath, I don't give you much chance anyway. What's with you, one? We saw it all die at I bid you, gentlemen, farewell. If I can't get rid of those two, I'll have to look for another way. We're no longer at home on our own island. Calm down. It's not worth the effort. I told him, that flunky, that he'll see what a real sailor has in his belly. If you continue like that, everyone will see what you've got in your belly. I hope so. And then he said, don't forget the lesson. you have no right to treat us like this. And the doctor, what did he say? He laughed. Calm down.
whale vertebra. If the newspaper clipping in the bar is true, this bone is a real fossil. Put that beast back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. Hmm. What's with you wandering around? We saw you all die of thirst the last. I bid you, gentlemen. If I can't get rid of those two, I'll have to look for another way. What's with you, Wanderer? So that I bid you, gentlemen, farewell. If I can't get rid of those two, I'll have to look for another way. Well, well, look who's back. Did you miss us? <laughs> I-I have an offer that could interest you. We're listening? I need you to keep them busy for a while. You send us to take the punishment while you go quietly about your business? What's in it for us? What would convince you to help me? There's only one thing that'll get us to move. For sure. Bring us something to drink and we'll take care of the bootleggers. Look what I've got. You're a good guy, you. Follow me. <coughs> Cheers, you jackass. Oof, I don't feel well. 
Hey, where are you going? Say that again. I hope for your sake that I didn't hear No, it. no, it's not what you think. It's just that you shouldn't hide your hooch in a fisherman. Let's see. Perfect. Ugh, oh, this place stinks. What is the connection between this place and the Sarah Hawkins case? What is this picture of Charles and Sarah Hawkins doing here? What happened here? Who has enough money to buy painkillers, but stays in a place like this? It smells as bad as it looks. Is this one of Sarah Hawkins' paintings? Someone has settled in here. And whoever it is, has something to tell me about the Hawkins case. Is there anyone in there? You! Don't move! You again. I told you to stay away from this warehouse. You seem like a competent officer. We should help each other. You're trying to manipulate me, Mr. Pierce. I hate to be taken for a fool. All right, Inspector Lestrade. Let me take a more direct approach. Can you explain what this painting is doing here? This strange portrait. Wait, I know it. It was in the Hawkins mansion when we came to investigate the fire. So you confirm that it was removed from the crime scene? Interesting. I'd like to go and see the mansion now. Of course. You want to go back along his trail? <sighs> I'd like to understand how this painting made it to here. Come on. My car is parked down the way. Andrews, would you please shut the door? And open your eyes, damn it. This guy went right under your nose. God damn it. Her again. This case has nothing to do with you, Baker. Clear the passage or I'll shut you up for obstruction. Officer Bradley, you've finally grown a pair. Too bad you're too fat to see them down there. Why you? Come on, keep the smile. You don't want to force me to widen it. Okay, I get it. Can we go to the mansion now? Who the hell are you? What were you doing on my turf? I've got my eye on you. We'll meet again. Is it far, this mansion? Look behind you, at the top of the ridge. You see the building? 
That's the Hawkins mansion. Come on, we got some driving to do.